Shalom guys, I hope that you are doing fabulous. Thanks for joining for a daily reading. If you are returning back, welcome back. And if you're new, my name is Shannon and I'm glad to have you. My channel, I, I read differently than what most people do. Uh, you'll just have to learn me as we go, okay? But I do like to tell new people who I am. I'm not a religious channel, but I'm going to come across real heavy that way, I'm sure, to some people. But I'm not religious at all. I'm just for the truth, the whole truth, nothing but the truth. A lot of times I'm looking at criminal activity or just uh, negative energy to up rooted or to encourage people to um, just look in the mirror because all of us has fallen down at some time in our life and uh, we got to look in the mirror when we fall down right and make a thing right so anyway um, I do incorporate the scripture because the scripture is found in the tarot and I love uh, the Hamashiach which is the Christ the son of the living Elohim I kiss the father uh, and uh, seek him in truth and uh, who is Jehovah? So you will hear me say Jehovah Elohim. People call him the universe, the divine. He is he's all of that. He's he's running the universe. He is divine. He's powerful. I, I fear him. That is the beginning of wisdom to fear Jehovah. He's an Elohim of war to stop it. Uh, he, he teaches our hands how to war. So people start some stupidness. We get up in here and let Jehovah just teach us how to war and uh, do what he wants us to do so anyway this is who i am take it leave it do whatever you got to do with it if you stay great i'm glad to have you i'm thrilled to have you grow with us otherwise thanks for checking me out if you got to go away happy birthday happy anniversary and all of that kind of stuff love and light to anybody who is down and out you'll have a discomfort their soul be the lifter of their head you'll have a come on in here and prophesy by way of the spirit of prophecy which is yeshua the great hamashiach You'll have a rebuke, bind, and block every wicked, foul thing. Give me just a second. <laughs> I had a couple of them that uh, just jumped on the floor. So something about the truth is here today. And uh, on my spoon reading, the truth was there. And there was a lot of pentacles everywhere. And the king of pentacles also appeared in that reading there. <laughs> Some type of truth about this king of pentacles or this pink king of pentacles has truth about something. Clarity. Okay, real sharp truth, a conception of a thought, communication about truth or something truthful is being communicated here. The King of Pentacles is very generous and professional. It could be a boss, a father, uh, an uncle, somebody masculine, somebody who will work with you, go slow with you. He's a very successful kind of a card to get. Um, very responsible, very practical type of energy. Uh, if this person's in the negative, he's very stubborn and greedy and jealous, okay? And so some type of a truth then would be coming out about this King of Pentacles as well in the negative side of things. So if you're upright, you're upright. Uh, if you're new, I hit energies both ways. So because we are dealing with people who are in some of this energy in the negative sense. There is a message here today and that also is showing up uh, within the spoon reading. This is an outgoing message. This is a favorable testimony. So if there's a favorable testimony about the truth and something has been mischievous around something, then something is here. we got little children and teenagers with this card as well for some of you all. Otherwise, it's just some type of a, of a truth here today. We have the star at the bottom of the deck. This is exposure. It's the pictograph of the mouth. So there is something being spoken. There is something being exposed. There's also a guided relationship when the star comes out. It's a happy kind of a card. It's about hope. Um, destiny, things like that, things that are being guided. Uh, all right, this is a healing card as well. Somebody's bringing truth and healing something, then that's positive. There's happy times then with the star uh, card. We also have uh, bitterness and bad luck uh, for some people in the negative of the star. And it will be known about as well. If you are dealing with somebody who is in the spotlight or something like that, then then the star is is just that the six of wands was in my spoon reading that's a you know like a public type of a card as well the sun was there that's front stage kind of stuff as well so something is being known even if it's just in your world or some type of a good communication that is bringing uh truth uh something could be creative around that attached to it um, but it is bringing healing if you are in the upright okay so yes yeah, some something's being known i'm just going to clarify the start something's going to be known about some oppression because there needs to be healing here within a matter something's also being known about a decision and somebody who's getting their balance or needing to get balanced or healing from that as well there is a decision here today and it's 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 been a heartbreak within some matter uh show me this decision 
show me more about the two of pentacles this could be a secret if something's known and being exposed about a secret physical exchange here that brought some type of a oppressive energy then that's here yeah there's the something is going to be victorious today so it's come out twice okay or something's known about somebody who is in the public eye got a following or something like that something mischievous was around some stupidness within a matter then so be it uh, but there is healing, there is hope, there is something guided, there is a victory within some matter here. Okay, show me the message here. Show me this. Show me the page. Show me the page. What's this page here for you? Hold on. So the message about um, being left out in the cold, um, this is like a throw out type of a energy. Somebody knows about that, then they do. Uh, the King of Cups is at the bottom of the deck on this message with some type of being left out in the cold or poor in spirit. And some this, this King, if he's not in the upper, if this happened to this King or this King did something, somebody's been talking about it here within some matter this king if he's not in the upright he's an intelligent manipulator and somebody manipulated something in a very mischievous way around some type of uh, communication uh, something can be known about it this is an ending here okay something's ending here there, there's a victory okay within the map there's a king of swords he also appeared in my spoon reading show me this king of cups what is this king of cups here the king of swords wants to come out on him um, somebody's ex could be here or these could be brothers these could be soulmates soulmates was being highlighted in my spoon reading the law messages around law and there's the truth there is something about the truth is here uh, the king swords if he's in the upright there would be truth here attached to something um, if he's in the upright otherwise this person's in debauchery there's a manipulator here somebody was very mischievous within some matter somebody's going to give a favorable testimony for the truth's sake and, and it's going to be clear around some ordeal there, there's for some of you all somebody's uh, insecure about some type of a uh, communication the home and a celebration situation is here show me the king of pentacles the backstabbing card betrayal of some sort is here that also break down to the ace which is the truth as well there's the queen of pentacles well those those two people showed up they've been showing up quite often here um one was on one of my channels yesterday and one showed up on the other channel uh so you know this is a married couple type of an energy or a match of some kind if you're not married there's some type of a match there's been some type of a betrayal here within this matter then so be it. Okay, somebody's business could also be here with the hermit here at the bottom of the deck. Let's see what the truth is. Show, show the truth. If this was a death, then somebody got slaughtered. Okay, somebody's given a favorable testimony about this, whatever has happened uh, within a matter. Uh, it, it, it is showing legal people out here. The key of cups can also go back to FBI energy with the eighth house, water. All right, so love situations, intimate relationships, decisions with the lover's card, the truth about that. There's the empress. Okay, well, the empress is the most beautiful uh, person for the feminine in the deck, right? We have the upper and the lower version of the empress here. Okay, something's happened within some matter, even between two people. Somebody mischievously did some stupid because they did know about a guided relationship because the empress represents somebody who has a counterpart, which would be the emperor. Uh, like power couple type of energy when they come out. She also holds the skills of justice within her as well. This is pregnancy with her, projects, okay? Somebody had an intimate relationship. The, the ace is a pregnancy as well. If somebody, so somebody betrayed somebody within a relationship like that or somebody died because of something that went down like that and the truth is being known about a decision that has been um, physically exchanged, caused some type of war and an oppression, uh, then there's, there's some some type of a message that's going to close something out, all right, within this decision about around the truth. Uh, somebody will get justice because she holds the justice skills within her. You hold that you just uh, pick through my hands. 
If you're new, I have a deck here that I'm picking. Uh, it's just a homemade deck. I got anything that could come out of this deck. Whatever Yehovah wants to bring out, I don't question it. it. Might be strange energy for you coming out on the card, but for somebody else, it may not. Okay, so just take the pieces that resonate and chunk out the rest. I'm gonna take several because I feel like I'm supposed to. <laughs> so Yehovah, you just you know all things for any given person. Okay, so the righteous man wisely considers the house of the wicked. Elohim overthrows the wicked for their wickedness. So somebody out here has been wicked, okay, so especially with that stuff, especially if that's a murder, all right. Um, somebody was a liar in my spoon reading, and there was, sac the, the hangman was there, which is a sacrificing rune, but in wording, it came out sacrificing of animals and people, okay, that's wicked, okay, you don't sacrifice people, that's disgust, anyway, so the righteous man is wisely considers the house of the wicked. Okay, so if you're righteous, you will consider. Okay, you won't go by their path at all. Elohim is going to overthrow somebody's wickedness uh, today. Okay, so that, that's positive. Let the wicked just get the crap out of the earth. Okay, you are your only limit. If somebody's feeling insecure about getting up or a couple people are a little insecure about getting up and giving this favorable testimony, you're your only limit. There's a victory out here around some matter. There's truth and clarity. Uh, there's a match here. There's soulmates involved in things. We've got the angels here blessing. Uh, also a union around some ordeal as well, especially with the empress being here. Um, there's a lot of people showing up out here. There's also, there's the queen of cups. There's the page of uh, wands again. We've got two kings, here, three kings here, another queen. Uh, we've got people that keep showing up because we've got something public out here. But there's the emperor. Okay, well, the emperor and the empress. Okay, a high volume couple, um, or you're dealing with your grandparents within a situation, mother father situations, uh, you know, empires. We did have a king and a kingdom and a queen that came out in wording as well. Okay, so something though is blessed around some union. Okay, there's a match out here. Two people just went through some hardcore stupidness, then something's here. Uh, whatever this is, some of y'all have somebody who is very mischievous about a throwout situation. Somebody will get justice within that. Okay, somebody gonna get the door shut up on them. We've got army energy that could be here with this. We've got anxiety that can be here with this uh, when these two um, cards come together in the Hebraic language. We have somebody that um, is dealing with um, music and things like that. Okay, because it goes back to a band of men, and I know that represents uh, military stuff, but we're talking about a band or somebody who's just um, um, uh, talented because the star is here. I always just bring it out with the emperor and the empress. There's a lot of money around some situation, but there is something about a marriage or something like that is here. The higher fit appeared twice um, in two different decks in my spoon reading. Anyway, if you deal with somebody uh, in the connection has lung problems or something went down with somebody who had lung problems, this is air here as well, whatever that is, and something's happened here. Um, something about somebody's skin is here. Look, if you're prejudiced, go ahead and just exit off my channel. Don't you ever come back to my channel. You're never welcomed on any of my platforms. Get out. You're stupid. We have a, a male uh, within a family, this is somebody who speaks for the family, which would go to the emperor. Okay, somebody would get up and take charge within some matter. Um, so there's something like that. We're dealing with, uh, you know, the pandemic and stuff like that. And I think that goes back to your lungs and things as well. Um, somebody going to be feeling like a kid again because there's a victory out here. Something's guided within some matter. Okay. Somebody says, I will face the mirror. That's positive. Somebody had 24 hours yesterday to do something or they weren't going to see something that was coming in a very big way. So somebody's facing the mirror. Then the, the twins are here that also has that type of the energy. Um, then somebody's being told also to face the mirror. Um, there was a misunderstanding and, and there's going to be a forgiveness and something's going to be fixed within some ordeal. Uh, or deal, dear. <laughs> anyway, uh, some fear has been around some ordeal, but there's joyfulness here. Now, the joyfulness card came out in my other little card on my spoon, so that's amazing. There's also a yes written on that card as well. So, what we do have somebody is insecure about giving some type of a message, maybe to their empress, okay, maybe to their emperor, okay, or about a mother, father, grandparent situation. 
uh, what what was back you know backstabbing or a betrayal within some matter. We got inheritances and large sums of money here with the ten of pentacles. There's there's a commitment out here. There's some type of commitment out here. I'm willing and truthful and mute. It's mutual out here. Yes, because that's a perfect match. Okay, we got matches here. Something very much fortunate is here. Something about out of state is here. And you hope his plans are to prosper you and to give you a hope and a future. We have hope right here. And yes, there was prosperity all over the place. Double for your trouble had came out in that other reading. So the people, oh my gosh, you people who have been with my channel for a long time, you already know what I'm going to say, don't you? <laughs> on the subway and there's the emperor so if you are new i have so many um i have so many videos on my channel that when the emperor comes out 99 percent of the time on a subway and a bike energy will come out uh on him but on a subway comes out on him so whatever that is <laughs> That's amazing. A lover energy is here as well. And we also have a widow that had been bound in grief. And Jehovah says um, that uh, there's a new relationship here and somebody's going to be delivered. Or maybe somebody just feels like everything just died and you went through some type of a situation. Uh, or your mother was a widow uh, and something's happened within a matter. Whatever that is. Somebody, some type of situation around a widow. And we always get the widow and the widower as well that comes out. Uh, in matter. So let me go ahead and take this uh, other card deck and uh, see what comes out. Oh my gosh, if I can get them, <laughs> if I can get them situated here. There's messages coming today, and it, it, it's a good message, and it's going to bring some type of a healing guided public victory somewhere. If these are all family members, and there could be family members out here. <clears throat> Thank you. So, yes, the letter came out in my uh, spoon reading. This is something that somebody's waiting to hear. All right. So, we, we, you know, somebody, somebody's waiting for this communication. Whatever has been. All right. And somebody has wisely con uh, considered something that has went down around some evil person or people's organization. Because the hierarchy can also represent organization as well. And somebody's words are going to be overthrown, okay? So Jehovah's going to overthrow just the wicked in some type of situation, okay? Because somebody has been wicked out here behind somebody's back and did something. Uh, consolation, somebody was looted on, okay? Somebody uh, is deserving of what is theirs with this card. You see somebody up here praying and everything else. Uh, so, you know, if we are dealing with spiritual matters or a spiritual person, then that's a spiritual person energy as well. Somebody's on a pew. So there's spiritual matters out here. And somebody is entitled to something that they were looted on. Okay. Uh, we also have the hostile, stupid person that don't have no patience at all. They fly off the handle. Okay. That's why they cause the stupidness. Okay. There's been caution around some, there's bad luck coming to some people and there's good luck coming to others. Okay. Because we got a winner and a loser type of energy out here. So whatever's going down, somebody got some bad luck. If you are dealing with some type of a fire situation, then that's also showing up here. Let's take a rune. What's at the bottom of the deck? Yes, fortune. There's a there's this is a victory, a string of luck. There's also a lot of fortune that's coming out, and somebody's gonna get double for the trouble for some stupidness that's went down. We have the Wanjo, which is the V and or the W. We also have in the Hebraic language, the V and the W is here. All right, West Virginia could be here real big then being, being highlighted here. Um, this, it, it looks like the P. We also have the Pay, which is the letter P here. Okay, so let every word be established in two or three witnesses. This is a satisfaction rune, and we do have this victory out here. Somebody else is losing something because they're a wicked person. They will be overthrown within this war that's gone on, the mischievous nastiness that's happened. Somebody's hit rock freaking bottom, okay, when this comes out. But this is a rebound after that because Jehovah is good all the time. He's good. Um, this is about faithfulness. If somebody was protecting their baby doll within some matter, this is protection. Then the emperor would, would very much do that around uh, a situation. Okay, um, This is career and opportunities. We have boss figures here and here as well. So it went down at work, then, uh, then it did within a matter. 
This is also going to be help within a, a work or career as well. There's opportunities with this. And wishes are going to be granted today, people. And that's positive. So the wicked are going to be overturned. There's a victory. There's a string of luck here. Uh, there's something public. There's something guided within some matter. And so if you are in the upright, then that's great. We, we get the victory today. We, we, we declare to see it, Yehovah. We just thank you. So, uh, again, um, a lover situation, a widow on a bus or a subway, a bike is here, or a motor motorcycle as well. God's plans or Jehovah's plans are to prosper us and to give us a hope in a future and not to harm us. Okay, something about happened out of state. Somebody is willing and truthful and uh, it's mutual. There is joyfulness. There is a yes out here on the other side. There's fear because the wicked person is going to be overturned. Something happened around some misunderstanding. It got out of control and now some bad luck came out of some ordeal. If you don't forgive, you're never going to be forgiven as well. This is what Jehovah stated yesterday. But Jehovah said, go fix it and to forgive. Two days in a row, he stated uh, forgiveness you. You ain't going to be forgiven. So there's a forgiveness energy is out here. If you ain't going to do it, you will, you're will. you not going to see something that happens to you. It will hit you right beside your head and you'll be dead. Okay, let Jehovah take care of you then because he stated he was going to yesterday. Facing the mirror, feeling like a kid again, something around the... Um, pandemic and the lung problems and you are your only limit today and you're dealing with somebody or that's you that gets up and speaks for your family it's time to get up and speak within some matter and give some favorable testimonies for some of y'all these are family members it's time to get up and do something okay if somebody's been trying to protect something and hide something it's bad luck on them today their karma is here okay within a matter uh something around skin or uh you know prejudice stupidness uh is here then so be it then that's here as well people this is what come out until next time shalom